Hello everybody and welcome to this short video where I'm going to be going over very quickly how you can go about editing the menus that you have within Unreal Engine. So um, there's a number of different ways to do this. You can probably do it through C++ and a couple of things, but what I usually use is Python. So um, Python is inbuilt into our Unreal Engine. It'll have its own setup imported and built uh, at the point that you, you build it. And it can be used for numerous different things. But in this case, I have written a little script and what this is going to do is I'll share this script in the description of the video. What this is going to do is it's going to create a new menu. And once I've created the new menu, it's going to add in a couple of different uh, options, things that I think you commonly might do. One of them oh, I'll show you in a second. But the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to select all of this and um, You'll see down in the bottom, we've got a choice that we can either run sort of the console commands or we can run Python or Python replicated. We're just going to go with Python. I'm just going to paste the script in here and press enter. And you'll see up in the top here, we have a new um, example menu. And I've got three functions that we can do here. One of them is we can open a URL and all that will do is open up a URL somewhere. So uh, it's an example of, of how you can use it to uh, do stuff outside of the engine slightly. Um, the next thing that you can do is run an editor utility widget. So in this, I've hard coded it to run the example in the content directory. So if you don't have it there, this isn't going to fire it up. Uh, but if you want to just create the example and it will fire it up. OK, an editor utility widget is a menu system that is used as an extension of the engine. So uh, you can create tool menus uh, like uh, and dock them in and have your own functionality behind them. So there you go. That just fires up that edit utility widget and I can edit and change that myself. Final one I've got is to uh, run a Python script. Now this will just call an, uh, a Python script um, and that can do numerous different things within the engine. So this is just an example of adding something to the to the menu bars. Now if you want to change this uh, again I've given you the code I'll give you the code so I really leave it up to you to go in see how the codes works and, and change stuff around but one of the things is if you want to add something to any of these other menus you are going to need to reference it and um, you're going to need to reference it and place place the values in here so that you can edit them how do you get those now if I was to come down into go back to command there is a option and that is tool menus dot edit one so that's turning on the tool menus edit functionality now when I do this you can see that we suddenly got a whole bunch of um, buttons that we can change stuff with now, this already gives us a bunch of functionality. We can make things hide things and throw stuff off, but you're going to find it difficult to create new elements. So we can move stuff around. We can do a number of different things with the bars, um, but it's not, it's not necessarily easy to add anything in this way. So this is why you would want Python, because you can see here, I can edit the menu that we've created here and change the order. I should be able to do that. But the main thing that we're looking at is this, because this is going to give us the tags that were required in order to change stuff via Python. Now, I edited, entered the code in down here. That's probably not ideal. You probably want this to run on startup. Now, we have another option. If you come up to the project settings and search for startup, you'll see that 
under Python here, plugins Python, you'll see that we have an, op an array where we can add scripts in. So if you added that script in here, your tailored version, that would fire up on uh, on startup of the engine. So um, this was where you would want to put your, your startup scripts that edit your toolbars. So again, we have, um, in order to find out what what menus to edit, we use tool menus.edit one. And to um, and that will bring up these elements. To turn it off, you just need to change that to a zero. And um, we need to write a Python script and run it in order to add entries into any of these different places. Okay, I hope that was useful. Thanks a lot, everyone. Bye.